This tutorial will show you how to review your clinical data and send any discrepancy or information about your review uh, via email. So let's say, for example, I'm looking at a case report form, and it could be annotated, and it could contain information uh, that's important. What I can do then is I can tap on this uh, button up here. What it does is it takes a screenshot capture of whatever view I'm currently on and you can you know, annotate by drawing and circling and making notations anywhere within the page. And once you're finished with your annotations you can tap on this right button that essentially captures what it is that you've annotated and you can then uh, email this to any colleague, data manager, biostatistician about this data issue. So you can type in a short message like, um, you know, there's an error here or something and hit send. And this will actually send that screenshot along with, with the email, it makes that little sound on, uh, and it will actually send it to your um, email. In this case, I have it on my PC, so let me see if I can open up that email here and show you uh, that it was just emailed. So that message about that error uh, on my PC appears and uh, I can open up that screenshot um, which appears you know, rather big. It's pretty high resolution. I can shrink it down a little bit. Um, let me go back to it. I closed it down. Um, so you can actually have the recipient review whatever it is notation that you've made along with the comments that you had on the email um, and they can you know respond back so this can be applied to when you're in the uh, case report form view or even in the data set view uh, or the variable attribute view it's actually any screen here you can tap on uh, the screen capture and then you have the ability to annotate or note and mark up whatever message you'd like to have and then um, click it and send it that way. Now in the event that you are on an airplane or uh, at a location where there's no access, let me go ahead and change this to um, airplane mode here. So in that case there's no way of immediately emailing. So if I were to be so let me get back to the screen here, I'll delete this draft. So I wanted to send this and I don't have any access to the internet. It says that uh, do I want to save it into my camera roll. So if I said OK here, what it does is it saves it. So if I go to my camera and look at the, uh, the camera roll, you see that captured along with all the other pictures I have. So later on, when I do have access, so let's say I'm now back at a location where there is internet connection once again. Um, so if I go back, I can now at this point um, look at my picture. Let me go and look at it in my camera roll because that's where I saved it. And in my camera, I can then at this point select on, um, you know, printing it out or emailing it once again. So uh, now I'm able to then email that those uh, that I've captured during my session of reviewing. So this will work either when you're offline or when you're back online. You can email those results and your findings of any of the screens that you have in during your clinical review, such as, let's say, in this case, the, uh, the data set view. So that's how you would be able to communicate data issues um, directly to people via email.